What's up, everybody? It's Dee's bro. I got a reaction. I'm about to react this new movie. Um, a country singer named Jason something right there, but it's called um, "Try That in a Small Town." Now, I guess it's talking about from the you know Black Lives Matter 2020 with George uh, George Floyd and all that kind of stuff when they're burning a lot of stuff and everything and. I don't think, uh, well, you know, at that time and everything, I'm talking about the whole country, the, the whole country was just going crazy at that time, man, that's like three years now, damn, that's a while ago now, but yeah, let's just, let's just, um, react this, alright, let's go straight into it, three, Somebody on the sidewalk, carjacking old lady at a red light. Oh uh, man, I'm gonna lie. I'm already, I'm already feeling the vibe. Let me go back a little bit. Let me go back right there, man. I'm feeling the vibe. Sucker punch somebody on the sidewalk, carjacking old lady at a red light. Pull a gun on the Damn. Of a liquor store. That was a crazy time. Man, that was a crazy time, man. I don't know why people were just doing this stuff to, like, communities and everything, burning everything, man. That was a, that didn't make no sense to me because that was people's, people's only community, too, and it was just burning it. And, and you know, and, I, and you had some people was talking about, it, oh, well, we can, they can get insurance and help. Like, man, you think that's cool? That's not cool still, man. You guys are freaking stupid for that. Let's go, let's go. Uh. Oh. Mm. Small town, South town. Yeah, at the time, everybody was panicking at that time, man. He said, who got it? Who? he right. People was, man. It was going crazy. Everybody's really talking. Damn. I'm telling you, man, this was a crazy year. That was a crazy year, man. It was just all divided so bad. Bad, bad. And then it was all the way. And it's still in, in this kind of way. But it's not burning, though. But it's just everybody's on this side. Other ones on the other side. I just want to be on the right side, not trying to dis disrespect somebody and burn somebody, break somebody's, I don't know, anything like that, man. It's just, if you if you have a disagreement, you should be able to have a conversation before you break some or do something. And, oh, well, I, we have to. You Why? You don't have to do nothing like that. Like, what did those people do that did anything to the person to break their things or anything? That's one thing that I just don't never understand about that stuff, man. Try that in a small town. 
I don't see how this is racist at all. This is crazy. These farmers are dropping their own crops for the day. A friend is in need, and they've come to help. It's what this community and a lot of our community stand for. Somebody needs some help, you'll get it. USA, USA, USA. Okay, man, that was really hit you right there, man. It's just I don't understand how people call it racist. This mo this song, this music video, and everything. It's just like and then it doesn't even say anything to this side and that side. But just to say that at the same time about this in my town, I could just say one thing. They're just trying to, all right, man, because they're trying to say. um police brutality right and this one guy in my can um my town okay this dude was right there he was driving like 70 and you're supposed to only go 30 and he and he like when he drove over a a black i mean into a stoplight okay now when he did that stuff he it's right next to a school and it was and i think the person was like 17 years old now he had a Mercedes. I, I I guess he's probably he was a black dude and everything. And what had happened was a cop seen him and tried to like pull him over, but that dude just keep going like seventy into right the same place. And what happened was everything just got all bad. Is he just keep going and other cops trying to get him though? Just like he went into a high speed chase and then he crashed luckily he didn't hit nobody right there like a kid or anything else but that dude was like a teenager too but he just you know i don't know he's just not thinking and then when he crashed that dude jumped out the car and he started running and the cops stopped him they went over there to arrest him they did then after he went to the news <laughs> and this this like teenager was trying to say police brutality like <laughs> And he was trying to, trying to have people over there, trying to, everybody trying to like to fight it right there from the Black Lives Matter. I'm like, dude, that doesn't make no sense. Man, just, how about you just say that you're just wrong? You just want 70 at 30. And then you freaking went to a high speed chase. And then you crash. And then you ran. <laughs> that didn't make no sense. It was just crazy time. There's way more stuff right there, but that was crazy. And that's why that makes me think about that time too. Everyone was just saying everything was racist at the time. And oh no, you understand. But if we could talk about the George Floyd with that thing, it, it went to that side, it went into actually countries too. Different states, countries was talking about this. Like, man, what do, what does that care about? I mean, not, not care. I shouldn't say that. That's wrong. But what the heck changed everything from that different state to this other state? Doesn't mean everybody has different rules. You know, I mean, yes, it's all about the same thing, but there's different things on it. And he was like, no, so, so, so. like, nah, come on. You guys don't even understand anything like that. But all right, man. Um, thanks for looking, l listening at this. Like, subscribe. All right. And show love. All right. And hit me on the comments. All right. Peace. <laughs>